Hi, everyone. This week, we celebrate Christ, the King of the universe. It is the very last week in the church year. Wow, look at that. We went all the way from Advent to Lent to Easter to ordinary time in the very last week in the year. Next week, we begin the new church year with Advent. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Pilate called Jesus over and asked, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus answered, Are you asking this on your own, or did someone tell you about me? You know I'm not a Jew, Pilate said. Your own people and the chief priests brought you to me. What have you done? Jesus answered, My kingdom does not belong to this world. If it did, my followers would have fought to keep the Jewish leaders from handing me over to you. No, my kingdom does not belong to this world. So you are a king, Pilate replied. You are saying that I am a king, Jesus said. I was born into this world to tell about the truth, and everyone who belongs to the truth knows my voice. The Gospel of the Lord. This week's gospel comes from when Jesus is brought to Pilate at the end of his life. Pilate was the Roman ruler of his area, and the religious leaders had brought Jesus to Pilate to get him in trouble. They wanted to get him in trouble because he talked about the kingdom of God and how everyone could reach the kingdom of God through Jesus, not through the religious leaders. That took away their power. At the same time, the Roman rulers did not want anyone else to think they could be king because that threatened their king. All of this is very interesting because Jesus flips the whole idea of being a king and having a kingdom on its head. Pilate asks Jesus if he's the king of his people, the Jews. Jesus wants to know if Pilate thinks that Jesus is a king in his own heart or he's just saying what others are saying. Jesus is also asking us who we think he is, and if it comes from our own heart. Who do you think Jesus is? Does your view of Jesus come from your own heart or from what others say? Jesus answered Pilate that his kingdom does not belong to this world. Not that it would limit him. If Jesus and his followers wanted it, they could have fought him from getting in trouble. But fighting is part of the world of trying to take power from others. The world of putting myself first. The world of wanting to have something others don't. But Jesus' kingdom is different. It's the world of wanting justice and putting others first and wanting to win God's presence to take over the heart and wanting everyone to have that. Somehow, Pilate realizes there's something special about what Jesus is saying and then there must be something to his kingdom. He must be a king in some way. Jesus now sees that Pilate is saying from his own heart that Jesus is king. Jesus told Pilate that he came into the world to tell the truth, and those who are part of his kingdom can understand what he's saying. It's a kingdom of truth and a king of truth. What truth does Jesus speak to you?